And she said, no, I'm going to be patient. I'm not going to report him. But if he kills me, I want you to be the one to know that he killed me. I want you to know that he did it. And I kept on telling her, you need to report your husband. And she said, he's going overseas tomorrow anyway. But we'll talk about it later. And I couldn't wait to confront this brother and to see what I would say to him. And then two weeks later, she sends me an email. And she said that, Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, my husband has agreed to divorce me. He's overseas and I'm free. She said, I saw a dream. And in that dream, there was a person that was nursing my wounds. And this is a real life story. And you know, the Prophet ﷺ said that there would come a time where the dreams of the believers are rarely untrue. 